Welcome back into Good Morning Maryland 615 right now. Southwest Airlines is by far the largest carrier at BWI Thurgood Marshall Airport, and that airline's been having major problems since yesterday. A technical issue causing hundreds of flights to be delayed or canceled. WMR2 News' Mark Roper is live at BWI this morning. So, Mark, how busy is the Southwest counter right now? Good morning, Christian. There is a sizable number of people here at the Southwest ticket counter this morning. Although I will say we were here about a month ago, right before Memorial Day weekend, and we saw a lot more people traveling then. So right now the lines don't seem as bad as you might think. I also took a look at the flight board and when you look at the flight board, there aren't a ton of cancellations or delays, and that could be because as Southwest, Southwest officials say they're in the process of getting things back to normal, but it is costing passengers time and money. For two days, customer service agents face long lines of frustrated passengers at the Southwest ticket counter. Tuesday's delays and cancellations came a day after Southwest and several other airlines experienced technical issues caused by a weather computer problem that kept information from being sent to flight crews. And some people tell us they had very little notice about the cancellations. One woman says she drove three hours from Pennsylvania to take her daughter to the airport and didn't get a notification about her daughter's flight being canceled until they were 20 minutes away. For many travelers, it means lost vacation time and spending more money than they had planned. We was out to visit family, so now we got to figure out where we're going to stay for the next two days. We, we did a rental car. I mean, we just need to be compensated because they, they, they canceled our flight. So I feel like we need to be compensated for the fact that we got to stay up in the area for two days. Now, Southwest posted this message on Twitter Tuesday afternoon, which reads, we are in the process of resuming normal operations after a system issue this afternoon that created flight disruptions throughout our network. We know many customers still require assistance and are working to address those concerns as quickly as possible. Now, Southwest advises its passengers to avoid the long lines like this by using the self-service option on their website by just going to the flight change option. And you can look for a link to that on our website as well, WMAR2news.com. Reporting live at BWI, Mark Roper, WMAR2 News. Okay.